French Open, Coco Gauff and Leila Fernandez into fourth round at Roland Garros. The two teenagers move into the second week at Roland Garros. Coco Gauff has won all of her matches so far in straight sets. Leila Fernandez will now make an appearance in the second week of the French Open for the first time. Coco Gauff and Leila Fernandez have progressed into the French Open fourth round with Fernandez reaching the second week of the clay court Grand Slam for the first time in her career. Gauff showed her confidence on clay during her straight sets 6-3 6-4 win over the world number 46 Kaya Kanepi on Friday. Sponsored link. Dental implants for seniors are paid by Medicare in Bangkok. See how. Dental implants for seniors. Sponsored listings. Recommended by. Fernandez went the distance on court Philippe Chatrier and came out on top 7, 5, 3, 6, 7, 5 after a lengthy contest with Belinda Bensick. Order of play I women's draw I men's draw I news in brief. Get Sky Sports, download the Sky Sports app. Composed Gauff dismisses Kanepi. On court Suzanne Langlin, Gauff continued to show she will not be daunted by opponents who have been on tour for a lot longer than she has. Her third round opponent Kanepi is double her age and was playing an ITF event the week after Gauff was born. Gauff and Kanepi spent just 83 minutes on court, with the American closing out the match on her first match point. She has now won her first three matches of this year's draw in straight sets. Gauff is the 18th seed and she reached the quarterfinals 12 months ago, before losing to the eventual champion Barbara Krasikova. I knew going into it, it was going to be a tough match, Gauff said on court after. She beat Garbinier Muguruza in the first round, who is a tough player to beat. I also played her in the past and we had a close, tough two-set match. I've been coming to France since I was 10 years old so I think that helped me a lot. I guess it makes me a clay court. I don't want to say specialist, but you. No, good at it. Gauff will next test her clay court skills against Elise Mertens, the 31st seed, who also came through in straight sets. Fernandez wins Thriller to reach second week. Fellow teenager Fernandez reached the second week at Roland Garros for the first time after her 7-5-3-6-7-5 victory over Bensic. Fernandez and Bensic spent 2 hours and 49 minutes on court Philippe Chatrier, with the Canadian going 2-0 down in the decider before coming out on top. I am very happy with the match and thank you all for the support, Fernandez said. It was a difficult match, but it's one of my dreams to be able to play on this court. Twitter. Due to your consent preferences, you're not able to view this. Privacy options. Anisimova threw after Muchova injury. Amanda Anisimova, Fernandez's opponent in the fourth round, advanced after Karolina Muchova was forced to retire due to an ankle injury. Muchova, who ousted title contender Maria Sakkari earlier in the draw, won the first set against Anisimova, coming back from a 5-1 deficit in the tiebreak. She then called for a medical timeout and had her left thigh taped. The physical issues continued shortly after for Muchova. She rolled her right ankle and fell while trying to hit a return at 2-2 in the second set. Muchova hid her face in her towel and cried as the physio heavily taped her ankle. She tried to play through the pain, before eventually calling time on the match at 6-7, 9-7, 6-2, 3-0 zero down. It's very tough and I feel really bad for her, Anisimova said about her opponent. She's had a tough year with injuries. Three years ago, 20-year-old Anisimova became the youngest American to reach the Roland Garros semi-finals since Jennifer Capriati in 1990. Anisimova and Fernandez have met on tour just once previously, with Anisimova having to retire from their contest at Indian Wells this year. Sasnovich defeats Kerber to advance. Aleksandra Sasnovich, who beat Emma Raducanu in the second round, has continued to play positive tennis and has knocked Angelique Kerber out of the draw. Sasnovich had lost to Kerber in three sets recently in Strasbourg, but this time she came out on top in straight sets 6-4, 7-5, 7-5. She hit 44 winners to just 14 from Kerber and was purposeful behind her first serve, winning 75% of points on it. 
Sasnovich has only lost one set so far in the singles draw, the first set that she played against Radicanu in the second round. The 28-year-old will now take on the world number 59 Martina Trevisan. Trevisan overcame Australian wildcard Daria Seville 6-3 6-4 on Friday. Seville had previously beaten Petra Kvitova but was not able to stay with her Italian opponent, who converted every breakpoint she created during the Elsewhere in the draw, Jill Teichman and Victoria Azarenka spent 3 hours and 18 minutes on court, with their contest going all the way to a final set. Mashti break. In the end, Teichman gained the momentum at just the right time, and she completed a stunning comeback to prevail 4, 6, 7, 5, 7, 6, 10 to 5. Sloane Stevens ended the run of Frenchwoman Diane Perry, who had knocked out the defending champion Barbara Krasikova in the first round. Stevens prevailed 6-2 6-3 on court Philippe Chatrier and will take on Teichman in the fourth round. Don't forget to follow us on skysports.com slash tennis, our Twitter account at Sky Sports Tennis. iPad and Android.